Hey everyone, I'm really excited to give you my two choices for some good summer reads. Um, the first one is called This Is My Brain on Boys by Sarah Strohmeyer. And I was drawn to this because the title is, it's going to get your attention, right? And it's actually really ironic because the main character, Addie, is not obsessed with boys at all. She's on track to going to Harvard and she doesn't have time for relationships. She doesn't have time for boys. So I love that it's ironic to what the, the cover and the title actually kind of leads you to believe. Um, so Addie is actually in her senior year of high school. She goes to a private school. And like I said, she's on track to wanting to go to Harvard. So she's in this class where she has to do this experiment um, to kind of like gain attention from Harvard and to maybe get her a scholarship. And her experiment has to do with love. See, because Eddie doesn't believe in love. She believes that everyone's brain is capable of love and she's actually putting together an experiment when she, where she has an equation that shows how anyone could fall in love if they follow this one equation. So she's very logical in her thinking, like, yeah, people can fall in love, and I can also avoid it by avoiding this equation. Um, so she's going through this with this experiment to prove that her equation is, is legit. Um, on her way to school over the summer, she's on this airplane ride with this mysterious boy, and um, they have a conversation, and all of a sudden the plane hits turbulence, and they're in this life or death situation. So they have conversation and they actually get to know each other more because they're in this state of panic. Uh, and they realize that they recognize each other from school, maybe didn't have classes together, but they definitely know of each other. And as they actually make it safe to the ground, one of them realizes they may actually know each other a little bit more than they realize. And um, when they get back to school, Addie's ready to start her experiment, ready to start off the school year. Now that she's gone through this crazy experience on the plane, she's like, oh, let me just refocus, get this experiment done. And she needs two people for the experiment to prove that her equation for love exists. And in walks this boy from the airplane. And now she's like, oh, man, is this going to change? Is this going to be a factor or mess up my experiment because now I know this kid from this plane ride. Um, you have to read to find out the connections that they have and um, how Addie's mind frame may change after she goes through this experimental process. Is love something beyond just this equation she made up? Read to find out.